Is Windows 10 better than Windows 8.1? For a lot of people, Windows 8 was a step backwards from Windows 7. It is hard to do worse than Windows 7. It had incredibly locked down administrative rights and an updated interface a lot of people hated. Windows 8 was jokingly referred to as the iPad wannabe, with a tablet look that looked ridiculous on a PC. At least Windows 10 is free. Windows 10 is free if you're upgrading from Windows 8.1 in the first year it is out. Otherwise, you have to pay for it, just like a Mac user tired of Apple's proprietary everything. Do I at least get the start button back? There are add-ons to Windows 8 that bring the start menu back, but yes, Windows 10 has that plus a lot of retro features. Then again, Windows 8.2 update gives that back too. Some of the retro features were why people did not like Windows 8 over XP. Windows 10 brings you universal apps. You have to install Modern Mix on top of Windows to get that in Windows 8. Windows 10 comes with virtual desktops, something that is almost impossible to get working in Windows 7 or Windows 8, short of being a system administrator. What about the troubleshooting and air logs? That's still hard to get to in Windows 10, though the diagnostic tools are supposedly better. At least you get task view. They stole that from Apple. Let's say they finally copied one of the better features of the Mac, also known as learning from the competition. I've heard Windows 10 has Cortana, the context-based search tool. It may be an improvement over Google, like bringing up the map to the restaurant you're searching for, plus the menu for the place. You do not sound too thrilled with it. Let's just say that it can come up like a cluttered version of a Google search. And you may not want a search log with all that information available to others, that's harder to delete than the forget my web history. It lets you save snapshots of screens and do a digital markup of them, while all the links are still active. At least if you print out the web page and mark it up, you have privacy. And Windows likes to save all the history, and even share it with Microsoft. The NSA has all that data anyway. At least Microsoft's Windows 10 lets you put browsers in reading mode, turning off a lot of the interactive content that is a distraction. I'm not sure turning my PC into an oversized Kindle reader is progress. At least Windows 10 is progress over Windows 8, if you do not like a computer that tries to pretend it is a tablet.